everybody welcome back uh it's time for another episode of moon knight episode five it's uh called the asylum i'm guessing that's what he's in like because he was shot the last time so i'm not sure if he's dead or if he's in his own head but he's in some sort of mental asylum where there are two of him right there's mark and steven they both have separate bodies so i'm guessing it's all in his head but also at the very end there there was that uh that other Egyptian god, I'm not sure what Egyptian god he is, like what, or she, like what it's god of, or what its name is, but what are they doing there? I don't know, I'm just confused, I've, I'm hoping there's some sort of explanation for it, so let's just get right into it. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to catch more. Let's do it. When is this? Your fault. <laughs> Calm down, Mark. Okay. Mark, I didn't shoot you. Your mind is violently vacillating between sense and what? nonsense. Right? Your brain what the fuck? is a pendulum swinging between a very difficult reality that you are my patient here at Putnam Medical Facility in Chicago, Illinois, and reassuring fantasy that you've created on your own that you're some kind of i don't know superhero all right you're what doing going everything on here? and everything possible not to look within you're not really a doctor is that why you keep starting imaginary fights in our hospital you're not a doctor <laughs> imaginary i i feel real i feel like a real doctor you're not a doctor well all right <laughs> i'm not a real doctor okay well all right all right all right it's not about me Okay, let's start with you. Let's try it your way. Retrace your steps. Tell me, tell me, how did you come to be here today? How did you get here? I took the bus. Like <laughs> I always do. You want to know what you told me? You told me that you were in a place that was oddly reminiscent of this office, except that it was in Egypt, and that you were with a rhinoceros. And a hippopotamus. You're right. I'm. You're right. <laughs> it, it was a hippopotamus, and it but it talked. Well, it said hi. Now, what do you think? Do you think that is sense or nonsense? Nonsense. He's making sense, but... I find this really encouraging. Honestly, he's fucking with him, right? I do. The struggling mind will often build places to seek shelter for different aspects of the self from our most traumatic memories. Okay? Some people, they see a, hmm. a castle. Right? Somebody else will see a maze. A psych ward? Yeah. Or it could yeah. be. Or you, yeah. A psych ward. Yeah. What I find extremely interesting is this new, um, the new animal character. Um, Hippopotamus. I find that really interesting. This hippo could break down the walls between you and Steven, and we might finally understand. What the hell's going on here? Understand what? Well... Before you got upset, you were talking to me about a boy. Do you remember that boy? You think you could tell me about that little boy? Boy. Hey, thank you. I feel really great. <laughs> I mean, they must pay you a lot of money <laughs> in this place. <laughs> you know, You're really good. I want to see myself out. Thank you. Doctor, I don't want to lose the You're going to lose this No, and hey, listen, Mark, be gentle, be gentle with him. Be gentle with him. Oh, shit. Okay, so now we're back here. Oh man! Wow, these meds are really amazing. Is he always so intense? Yeah, pretty much. So, are you two like twins? No. Well, yes, sort of. Hey, that's really cleared this whole situation up for me. Well, thanks to us, because just a second ago I thought that I'd been shot to death. Oh gosh, this will really bake your noodle. But I think you were just taking a little time out. What? I'm afraid you're actually quite dead. I'm sorry, what? What? I'm dead, we're dead? Yes. Huh. I think she's right, I think we died. This, this is the underworld? Actually, I have... Hold on a sec. It's been a minute since we've had a soul pass through here. Just what? Um... Ah, aha! Okay. Huh. Here we go. Welcome, gentle traveler... Uh, travelers. To the realm of the Juat. Juat, the Egyptian underworld. I thought this so. Is Tawerit, 
goddess uh -huh. of women and children. She's guiding us through our journey to the afterlife. Huh. <laughs> wow. Okay. Okay. Right. So this this is the afterlife. The afterlife. An afterlife, not the afterlife. Oh. You'd be surprised how many intersectional planes of untethered consciousness exist. Yeah. Whoa, okay. <gasps> like the, uh, anyway, I do actually have cards for all this, if you just wait. Uh, um, sorry. <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> Stephen uh, typed. Because the Duarte's true nature is impossible for the human mind to comprehend, right. you may perceive this realm as something more easily recognizable to you. A psych ward's a first for me, but... Okay. Hey, we can roll with it, right? Um, why would we imagine this realm to be a psychiatric hospital? Because we're insane. Yeah. We're insane, Stephen. Talking hippo. You're outside of my body now. And now the afterlife? Mark. That's <laughs> Mark's the having a meltdown. The hospital, that's the <laughs> imagination. Oh man, Dr. Harrow's right. Dr. Harrow? Doctor, now. I prove it to you. So, like, <laughs> right through these doors, for example, we go through here. There's going to be a bunch of patients, and there's Crawley probably about to yell, Bingo! Oh my god! Whoa, oh my god. they're on a boat? Going through the desert? Huh! What is this? This is the underworld. How cool oh is that? I'm oh, dead. Where did you say we're going? Uh, we're sailing to our route, to the field of reed, right, our edit? Ah, so he's the smart one, hey? Huh? Well, if cool. you're balanced in life, you will spend eternity in paradise, the field of reeds. Uh, before we get there, I've, I've just got to do a quick little... Uh... What's happened? <laughs> oh! Oh, goody! Oh, what the? Work. Look at that! There's little old me worrying I'd blow your chest wide open. What? Sorry, what? What what's she doing? Oh, just took their hearts. hearts. On the scales of justice and the fear oh. of truth. See, the huh. ancient Egyptians believed that the heart was was the sign of who you really were in life. Okay. If the yeah. scales balanced by the time you end the journey, then a soul is permitted to pass into the field of reed. Okay. You get thrown overboard. <laughs> the dead will drag you down into the duat, where you will remain forever. Oh, that you sucks. Souls on my boat. Them's the rules. Fingers crossed for you guys, hey? Huh. There's no way we're even up down there. Are all those... Not going to feel the reeds either. Is that all oh, people that have been oh. thrown off? If it comes to it, kill the hippo, steal the boat. What? <laughs> um, fellas? Can't steal the hi kill the hippo and steal the boat. Why is it doing that? I don't know. Because uh... one of you is good and the other is not. It's the hearts. They aren't full. It's like they each feel incomplete. What does that mean? Without balanced scales, it will eventually claim your soul. Do you have any other suggestions? This boat contains all of a life's memories. Now, I don't know what you two guys have been hiding, but my advice, huh. get in there and show each other the truth. Balance so they need to become one. Before we arrive at the field of reeds, or your souls will be destroyed. Yeah, okay. Right. So how are we supposed to do this? Come clean about everything, I guess? Yeah, for mm. now. And knowing her, she'll go on a suicide mission to stop her or herself. Well, that means we better hurry, doesn't it? Yeah, you guys you need know, to get would be all right with if she were here right now. No, just through here. I'm just saying there is one hippo and two of us, and this ship can't be that hard to steer, so... <laughs> you we don't can't have to actually, kill you know, a like, god. Can with the goddess tell it? No, just, yeah. you know, find me a rope and... and, 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 yeah. and or we can do what she says and, like, help each other uncover whatever it is that we're hiding, apparently. What memory is Oi, this? What's this? Steve, what are we going to do here? We're going to, like, revisit every single memory I've ever had? Do you remember this? Guess so. Yeah, I mean... I don't know, it's, it's a street. You know, how many streets have you walked down your whole life? It's important or else it wouldn't yeah. be there, right? Just a creepy the? camp filled with dead bodies. Sort yeah, this is. is weird. No prizes. Guessing whose room this is. Yours. Funny. These are the people he's killed? Dubai. Gabon. Yep. New York. No way. Oh, man. What, do you know these people? No. Oh, no. 
sure they're not. Yep. All of them? They were criminals, murderers, predators, the worst of the worst. Can't you wanted them punished? That's what he meant by protecting the travelers of the night. And you remember huh. each person. You tried taking a life. See how quickly you forget. That's fair, yeah. I kept wishing I'd fail. And one of them would kill me instead. The healing ended up being a curse. Mark! Do you see this? Look. Yeah. It's, it's, the scale it's slowing down. down is working. So, so the, now what, what? What do we do? do you, you go next, um, or? Who's that? Mark. Is that them as a child? Why is there a child in a room filled with people that you've killed? Don't, don't, don't hey, go near him. man. What's your name? There? Oh, hold on there. Wait a moment. Wait, wait a moment. Wait. Come on, now wait, see it, see it. Uh oh. Open the door. This is clearly Open something door. Mark doesn't want Stephen to see. What is it? Open the door. Mom. I was hungry. Roro. Mom, come check out my drawing. He drew the fish with only one fin. Mark, be nice to your little brother. Huh. I had a wow. I'm not hungry. Wanna go to the cave? We'll eat later. Boys, I'll be gone too long. Dad? Hey, 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 Mark. What do you do? Keep an eye on your brother, okay? Later, skaters. In a while, crocodile. Uh, I said, wait, let's go. What is Steven about to find out okay. here? Okay, 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 fine. But I'll be Rosser, though. Can you hear that, Dr. Grant? I sure do, Rosser. Dr. Grant. The movie. Mom said not to when it's rainy. It'll be fine. Don't be a baby. Where are they? Oh, God. No, no. Lads! You have to get out of here! It's gonna float up. Boys! The water's rising way too fast! Boys! Come on, lads! Oh God. Follow my voice. Boys! I hear you! I hear you! Uh, it's just a memory. This is brutal. Oh boy. Funeral? Hey, Steven. I want my Roro back. So the brother died. Huh. What are you doing here? Come on, buddy. You were supposed to keep him safe. Stephen, let's go. She blames him. Let him drown. This is all your fault. This is all your fault. Whoa. Stephen, come here. You can't Come put here. that on a child. Stop, stop. Don't go up there. Stop! Wendy? Wendy, come on, please. We're just about to blow out the candles now. Wow. She's not coming. She hates him. Your mother's not feeling well, Mark. We'll do it just you and I this year. You okay? Steven! Steven! Why doesn't Mark want Steven to see all this? Can't have a birthday without your favorite cake. It's not up. It's okay. Well, at least she's here. It's like she's wasted. You were always jealous of him ever since he was born. I sh should have known you would do something like this. What? What are you doing? What the hell? Steven! Mark. All right. All right. Why are you remembering her like that? It's not what she was like. Let me go. Let me back in there. What are you Where hiding? Where is it what she was Why like? Why are you hiding, Mark? Son, please come inside. She will get help. Dad? We will fix this. You're supposed to fix this. I mean, why haven't you? How long has it been going on? I cannot lose another son. You're not Steven. Huh. Off me. How are we now? Oh, it's just where Layla's father died. Oh God. 
Harry said you were a mercenary. Fuck. That you yep. killed hostages. And you believe that? Yeah. Wouldn't put it past you. <laughs> the job was to raid an Egyptian tomb. Bushman changed the plan, called for no witnesses, and I couldn't live with that. Does that <laughs> Dr. Fooley, Ayla's dad? Yep. I tried to get them all away. Oh, we didn't make it. What happened to you? <laughs> Is he in the sand as well? Whoa. Okay, so this is where you met Conchu? <laughs> Shit. It's about to die. What? What a waste. Ah. Huh. Hmm. Yeah. Huh? I feel the pain inside of you. I am the god Konshu, in search of a warrior. Huh. To be my hands, my eyes, my vengeance. To be my final word against the evildoers. To bind your very being to me and eradicate only the worst. Those who deserve it. Do you want death or do you want life? Huh. You didn't the really have mind. a choice. I feel it. Fractured. Broken. Most fascinating. Huh. You are a worthy candidate to serve me during this time. In exchange for your life, do you swear to protect the travelers of the night okay. and bring my vengeance to those who would do them harm? So this is how they came together. He was manipulating you from the start. Yeah. Oh, I kept us alive. He was taking advantage of you. Yeah. Or it was just a way for me to keep being what I've always been. A killer. Oh. Do you swear to Yeah. Look. Scales. Have we done it? Have we balanced them? Close. Then rise. Rise and live again. As my fist of vengeance. Moon Knight. Huh. Cool. Baboons? What, go, go, go. Baboons? Let's go. What? So where it? What's going on? Fear is spreading in the upper world. Unbalanced souls are being judged and condemned to the sands before their time. Oh, this uh, is bad. This is um, it. Hero, you see why we have to go back? Even if I could send you back up there, you'd just be returning to a body with a bullet in it. Can you send word to Layla? Please help us free Conchu. Are you sure you want to be with Conchu again? Seems like have you really to. to get away from him. I did, but this is our only shot. Please tell it. you have yeah. to help us. There's no other way. What the heck? Osiris is not going to like this. <laughs> His gate is the only path back. Get back inside! Get those scales balanced! Alright. Get away back up now. Hey, wait a second. Just give me a second here, okay? Um, we don't have to go back through it all again. We can just you do. talk. Let's just talk. Right here. Right now. I'll tell you. I'll tell you everything. I'm just begging you. Don't make us go there again. It's not well, worth it. Not worth it. Mark, you're about to lose everything. Do you understand? If we don't get back and Harrow succeeds and, and all those people die, if Layla dies, that's yeah. on your head. It'll be all your fault. No, 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 you can't. I won't do it. I won't do it. You can't make me. You can't. Oh my god. Not back here. Come on. Oh, Mark, what you've been doing is so difficult. I'm so what proud the hell? of you. Reliving these kind of traumatic memories can be so painful. And you have been at it for hours. <laughs> Why do I feel like, even though this looks the most real, the most plausible, that this is fake? And make you you. I'm so proud of you, Mark. Like, who would have now an office like decorated like that in Chicago? To consider this. Do you think I right? created Stephen to hide all of the awful things you feel you've done in your life? 
Or do you think Stephen created Lord to punish the world for what your mother did to you? Hmm. Huh. Can you remember? There's only one way <laughs> to know you're gonna have to open up to Stephen. There can be no progress without understanding. Okay. Can you open up <laughs> to Stephen? Okay, so this is what happened in the room. I don't... This is my room. I remember some things, but I don't remember this. Stop, Mom. It's not my mom. It's not my mom. Who is it, then? Open this door. Open this door! Bloody hell. Look at the state of this place. Oh my god! Better throw it out before mum sees it. Mark, open the door right now! Oh my god, Stevens is coping mechanism? When danger is near, Stephen Grant has no fear. Huh. You made me up. Open the door wow. right now! You're gonna learn. So listen. What the fuck? Father didn't do anything about this? I want to see what she did. I want to see what she did. Disgusting. You're not meant to see that. You're not meant to see that. That's the whole point of you. Huh. Oh. The point of me what to be your stress ball? All this time I thought I was the original. But I'm Damn. Something that you made up. You've got to live a happy, simple, normal life. Yeah. You understand? But it was all a lie, wasn't it? But what? What does it matter? What, you want to remember the truth? That you had a mother that beat you? That hated you? That, that made your life a living hell? You're lying, you're just trying to upset me. But you've gotten to live you thinking saw that it. she loved you. That she was kind. That she's still alive. She's dead? What? This life, I speak to her every day. What are you talking about? No, you leave messages. There's... No, this is all wrong. Steven, I'm sorry. Oh, no, 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 Dr. Harrow, yeah, is it? <laughs> I was beginning to worry we might never speak again. That's so strange. Huh? A little haircut, a little silly tash there. <laughs> it's very Ned Flanders. You're totally Steve, Ned Flanders. What's the way up to you now? It's my fault. I asked Mark to open up to you. Did he get a chance to speak with you? Yeah, well, he, he, he lied to me. That's what he did. And what do you feel that he lied to you about? Who knows he? <laughs> well, it's just, Stephen, when you first came in, Very here, suspicious. I was worried you were never even going to be able to acknowledge Mark. What do you mean when I, I brought this here? After your mother passed. Oi, don't say that. That's not true. Huh. That's not true. Oh, I'm oh boy. I must, I must you be say mistaken. that again. My mother is alive. You say I, that again. I, I, I will I, I, freak I, out. I, I must <laughs> be mistaken. You're already freaking out, would you, would you like to speak with her? Why don't we call her? But you don't have a number, do you? Yeah, we have it on fire. No, actually, don't do that. It'll take two seconds. It'll no, make you don't bother her. She's afraid of telly sales I'm sure people, she'll so talk to you. Sure, sure, I'm sure. Oh, you don't want to find out the Sorry. truth? Don't bother her, please. Uh, hello, Mrs. Grant. Yes, this is Dr. Harrow. Uh, Stephen's here. He'd like to speak with you. Steve, would you like to speak to your mother? What the hell? Okay, took you a minute to accept it. That's what he was doing standing on the street there. It's not gonna go in. At least your dad saw you. <laughs> it's 
was actually really upset. <laughs> Didn't really expect that. How mean she was to you? death and shiva two months ago this was the moment our lives started bleeding into each other oh it's two months ago i just couldn't i couldn't face that again of all the things i'd done mom all those horrible things that she said to you she was wrong it wasn't your fault no. hey did you feel that okay are you guys at osiris's gate we just stopped Gates of Osiris. Come on. It's time. Hurry. Okay, here we go. Oh, What's happening? I've never seen the gates to the world above so close. How do I open them? I'm so sorry. Your scales never balanced. Our journey's come to an end. I was really rooting for you guys, but the unbalanced souls of the Juat now must claim yours. No. Oh. Okay, this isn't terrifying at all. Look at that They don't look very friendly. Hi. No, not Hi. at all. Watch out, watch out, watch out! Uh, can't do anything to them, they're just sand. Okay. Is he gonna save him? Yeah. Shit! Is he gonna be able to do anything Mark. after this? We've got this. But if I'm you, it means I've got this too. Yeah, they're becoming one finally. Scales will be balanced. Nice. <laughs> Thumbs up. Oh shit. <gasps> what? Steven! Steven! No. Wait, wait, Steven! Run! No. Oh no. What? No more Steven? Oh well that sucks. Stop the boat! Stop the boat! Now it's balanced. Scales are balanced. In the field of reeds. What about going back up? What? What the hell was that? I don't even know what's going on anymore. Okay, okay. So, if it's not all in his head, then Steven's gone. But if it all is in his head, does that mean Steven's gone as well? Like, when he comes back to the office with Dr. Farrow, Will he only be Mark from that point on? Oh, I'm I'm incredibly confused, but I like that uh, goddess there. <laughs> she was funny, but I hope I really hope Steven's not gone because he provided like a lot of comic relief for the show. Like, I don't think it would be funny at all unless he was in it. So I don't know what's going on. We didn't get to see anything of like what's going on up top, but we did see those unbalanced souls being transported down into the sand so i'm guessing that amit is free or pharaoh is like judging a lot of people right now i don't know i guess i'm gonna have to wait to, for the next episode to come out to find out so let me know what you guys thought down below and if you liked it make sure to give us a thumbs up and uh subscribe if you want to catch more thanks for coming out guys have a good day